Hello everyone, this is Mario Nama, and I'm a bit late into the new year, and I've actually gotten this game, uh, this is a free-to-play game on Steam called Mandecon. Weird name, and it's a, supposedly a game about, uh, Tibetan theology. Hold on, let me turn down the volume a bit. Okay, let's see. Controls. Okay. It's a WASD control. Jump space. Six. Okay. Let's play a new game. And, um, this is all, this is so far on positive reviews on the storefront. And you are some really tiny, some really tiny clay dude, um, jumping up platforms, if you can call that, and this was, um, gifted to me, this is a free game, but it was gifted to me as a birthday present from one of my user friends, of course. Nice, it was my birthday like a few days ago, actually. And it's zooming up and E for enter. And this is really nice. I hope it's not this useless shovelware on Steam. And no, it's not! It's actually up the first level! There's a Tibetan prayer wheel. Yeah, this sort of reminds me of the level design in Uncharted 2 and Tomb Raider 2. If any of you, uh, remember it, of course. It's been a long time ago, man. Let's pause for a bit. And can you swim? I'm guessing you can't jump underwater. And it springs you up there. Nice. A totem glow provides escape when all is lit. All is lit, a door will gape. I haven't found any enemies in this level. E to write up. And nice little elevator. And the door lit up. Now, I have been wondering, um, people have been wondering where I am. Well, I got a few, um, things to do. In January and February. One is, um, besides this stream, by the way, uh, of Marlu Nama Plays, a blind let's play, um, I'm going to get to starting on the, uh, new episode of Tidbits. Um, and it's going to cover the, um, the saga of, uh, the now defunct digital homicide, how they began, stuff like that, and it's really worth, um, checking out. I'll even have an article to cover extensively um, the things that the video didn't cover, to be exact. So, and there's prayer wheels. You're some kind of Easter Island head, um, just bouncing around. Oh, 
I've always wanted to have a sky burial. You know, that's actually a rich a funeral ritual that they would practice in Tibet. Since the Himalayan mountains um didn't really um was actually uh very barren and uh they didn't really have any trees and lumber to um cremate the bodies, nor did could they be buried in the ground because the soil was too hot to um too hard, so they had to chop up their bodies and feed them to vultures. It's actually depicted in a couple movies, like that old movie, uh, Kundun, about the Dalai Lama. It's depicted in that movie. I mean, I can't jump up there yet. Um... I'm not supposed to go up there yet, I think. Can't get up there. Maybe it's just a climb. Okay, I like the environment for this. It looks very retro, and, um, but there is, I'm supposed to go back up again, but there's not much clue on what to do, and, but now I'm getting it. Karma right here. I like how they made uh, these 2D graphics um, sort of a 3D feel, make them feel like an actual flag. These are maps. Okay, and I, I presume we're supposed to make it to the top here. Um, yeah, and so far we're in the caves. Okay, tab to close. I don't use the tab key that much because... It's, except when I'm writing my books. Except when I'm writing, that is. And luckily this isn't free, so... This is free, actually, so... If you don't like it, you don't have to request for refunds, and of course, the people obviously are not prof profit-driven, like those charlatans at Digital Homicide, basically. I think if you, I think if you fall from too high of a place, whoa, I think you may get hurt, as I said. And I just... jump on there. Why wasn't there snow on there? Okay, maybe it was further underground. And there's more pieces. And no, you cannot jump on there. Well, that was a waste. I could have easily... This 
this is what Fez 2, in my opinion, this is what Fez 2 sh should have been before Bill Fish called it quits. This is actually one of the few games I played on this live stream that's actually pretty good. But the problem is it's probably going to be very difficult to find because many um, analysts on Steam, um, and as well as many YouTube personalities, claim that almost half of um, Steam's entire library of games were released in 2016. I'm pretty sure that the number of releases this year on Steam is going to be even bigger. Unless Steam does something. Unless Valve does something. I pretty much... 2017 is probably going to see even more games uh, released on Steam's library. Just continues the more... Um, the more they open the floodgates to... Um, to shit being on... To shit that doesn't work and... Is such low quality on um, onto the platform. And it's so much that this shit easily drowns out gems like this. This is one of those diamonds in the roughs. And okay, where's my life bar? A daughter's sleep, a wish to wake a door of light, her place to take. Okay, this must be some hint. View map, okay. Yeah, we're on halfway up top. Nice. Tab to close. What a weird location it is. Back. Almost there. Let's see what's over there, mind we? like the architecture there. I'm guessing this is the point of no return. Look at how high I'm up on Oleu! That was really stupid of me to say that. I'm guessing I've reached the end of the level! This must be the Tibetan Triforce, I'm guessing. Wow, look at those butterflies. And they're transparent. That's beautiful. Okay, where am I now on the map? Oh, this must be my checkpoint of the first level. Go into these huts, collect these. Now this was one of the good games on Greenlight. On Steam Greenlight. However, this could have easily been uh, used in the mobile uh, market as well. And this is obviously to go down. Oh man. This looks like a leap of faith. Ah, I'm dead. 
dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh no, I'm not. temple right here looks very beautiful. Alright, here's another little path. As the as blankets sheet find your rest, the life you sire is truly blessed. I don't even know what that means. But nice words of wisdom here. What am I supposed to do now? There's a Gerudo statue. I could fly! I could use fly with the Gerudo statue. What is it supposed to do? Oh, there we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, this hasn't been activated yet. I don't think. How do I jump down? Okay. Oh! That could have easily cost me my life. Okay, careful. Careful, Marlio. I'm a, I believe I can fly. Time these jumps well. Boom! Other checkpoint. I'm at the top! Success, but... Okay. Where I, I I collected one of these pieces. Now what am I supposed to do? Oh. 
you're supposed to go here. Okay, a never-ending folding ocean. Depth unknown, a child's devotion. Okay, of endless, new, and timeless old, we must let go these things we hold. Okay. Where am I supposed to go now? Okay. Now I'm supposed to make myself to the top again. Yeah, these birds are very musical. All right, elevator. Tab close. Look at that. I have so many places to go. Now nah, that was pretty dumb of me. Actually, maybe I should. Go all the way over there to apparently do something. Okay, have I been in there? And I think this is the completion of the level.
Okay. And how, is this an autosave? I'm not entirely sure. Okay, I've made it to the top. So, I will, I will, this is all I have to play right now, so. Uh, I will, um, come back 